guys, I'm at work today, so I just wanted to give you, for the first day, a little brief tour of what a hospital room all has in it. Okay, so, let me turn this around. As you can see, this is our trusty sink. A clock, so the patients know what time that will be here if we are away taking care of another patient. We have our sharps container our gloves to glove up and be safe. These are our machines that we use, our infusion machines. And this is the on and off switch. This is our little board where we um, write down our date, the name of the nurse taking care of the patient, the phone numbers. Over here, this is a nice second um, bed B room where you can see out the window. Not all rooms you're able to see outside. Um, this is the bed here. The bed has multiple functions. When your new patient comes in they get a little goodie bag. That's lots of fun supplies in it. Not really. Um, this is the call bell. If a patient needs you, they press this. Once this goes to the nurse's station, they page you with this pager. They put down why they need you, um, possible, unless um, there's no specific reason the patient doesn't say anything, then they just page you to this pager. Um, as a part of a nursing, you have to be located at all times, so you're also given a trusty locator. With this locator, it shows you, it when you're in the room, it shines directly above you. That little sensor right there, that little sensor attracts when you're in the room. So let's say a call bell goes off, the light above the door will blink, and when you come into the room, the locator automatically triggers that. They know that you're in the room, and that sensor will shut off. Therefore, the patient's needs will show that they have already been taken care of and that they no longer need assistance because you have answered it. Now, over here, is our suction gadget. This is where we hook up NG tubes and any other type of things. Um, this is the vacuum that allows us to control how much suction we need to use. Um, this is our um, call bell system. It's also for an emergency system. The blue means code blue. We don't want to press that. That is uh, if in an emergency situation a patient is not able to breathe or they're non-responsive, you go ahead and hit that. Otherwise, we have to call a special code into the hospital. Um, this is the cancellation of the call bell, and that's the call bell system, which is con connected to that button that I showed you. And, um, yeah, these are our trusty little TVs in the corner. <laughs> Won't be getting HD TV on that one. Um, and other than that, this right here is our trusty bedside commode. Dun, 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 dun. Yes. If patients are unable to walk, we can um, move them from the bed to the bedside commode to use the restrooms. That way they don't have to walk all the way to the, to the bathroom to use the restroom. All right, guys. We'll tune in today, too. Bye.